Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a gradient spiral in Photoshop. It's really easy. You start off with your background. Um, let's add a new layer. Grab your brush tool. Press B on your keyboard to do that. Uh, we're going to make sure that our opacity is at 100% and that we have the opposite color of our background. So if you have a black, black background, we're going to go with white. If you have a white background, you're going to go with black. Choose a random size and just scribble kind of like that. We're then going to select both our layers. I'm going to go press Command E. Um, to merge them together. Otherwise, you can just right click on them and merge layers. Next, we're going to go to filter, distort, twirl. We're basically done already. Look at how cool this looks. We want the angle to be either the negative 1000 or 1000. Um, if we want the full spiral, otherwise you can just twirl it a little bit. It still looks cool. I like to go with the max. Um, then I'm going to Command T to transform and make this a little bigger so that we get something like this. Um, almost last step, we're going to go to the Adjustments tab. If you don't have it over here, just go to Window and click on Adjustment. From here, we'll, we'll select a gradient map. Um, click on the slider and you can choose whichever gradient map pack you want. Um, I have some gradient map packs. The link is in the description down below. Um, I have some free ones, which are pretty cool. Um, from really unique colorways. You can also reverse them to get the opposite color. And also I have three premium packs the last premium pack, the volume three, just went out yesterday and I got some crazy color combinations. I think this is my best one yet. Um, and that's basically it. You can also add other adjustments if you don't really like um, how much black and white contrast there is. So you can just add a brightness and contrast adjustment and play around with these settings to have more color pop up. When you're happy with it, I'm just going to merge everything together and go to filter, noise, add noise. Just add a little bit of noise. And there's our spiral gradient. It's that easy. Um, obviously, it's always going to look different depending on your initial scribble, uh, but you can also do this with images on your background. It doesn't have to be a scribble. The scribble is just the fastest and easiest way, but if you download an image or have an image, open it up in Photoshop and just twirl it like we did with our scribble and the effect should be something similar. Um, and yeah, that's it. Um, feel free to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you in a couple days. Thanks for watching. Bye!